Yeah, groovy. <laughs> Welcome to Sailing Amory. I'm Janelle and this is John and this is our daughter Adeline. We are just an ordinary family showing you that you can make your dreams come true. We said goodbye to our life on land and we are now sailing our 43 foot yacht Amory. Join us as we set sail on our journey discovering what the beautiful world has to offer. Don't forget to subscribe so you can follow along on our adventures. Having spent a lot of time exploring Brampton Island in the past, and it being a rolly anchorage, it was time to keep sailing north. We've got all our sails out. It's only about 10 knots. We're going with the cover, with the current, so we're covering some ground. We set off on a short 10 nautical mile sail to Goldsmith Island. Goldsmith Island is the largest island in the group off Mackay. It has 674 hectares of national park with a rocky coastline long sandy beaches and fringing coral reef. They're groovy. <laughs> groovy, baby. are known to migrate through these waters between the islands, we got such a surprise to see a humpback whale and her baby playing not too far from where we had anchored. We have only seen a few whales from afar on our travels at this point, but I could not believe how majestic these creatures are. Just left the Goldsmith Island. There it is in the distance. And we're heading over to shore in between Lindemann Island and shore. It's hot. There's not much wind. I got all my sails and they're just flapping. 
pull them down and test out the engine. But it's a magical day. There's absolutely no wind, but this is just so nice. Oh, it's such a hot day today. Loving the bikini weather. No clothes. Perfection. We get to Hamilton. <laughs> we are buying some new ones. <laughs> My other one's broke, and this is all with sand on the boat. That's My it. eyes are burning. The water is that clear <laughs> out here. I had That's to use something. It. Leave a comment below if you like the sunnies and if you want to see more of them. Otherwise, give us a thumbs up if you want to see them gone. <laughs> Neck Bay on Shore Island. Um, we just came over from Goldsmith about lunchtime today, so we arrived. Now we've Oi. come over on the tender. We're not at Neck Bay. What? We're not at Neck Where Bay. Where are we? We're just like Shore Island. Where was Neck Bay? Over there. Boat. I lie. We're not at Neck Bay. So let's start again. Where are we? We are just at an anchorage at Shore Island. We didn't, well, we started off with the sails up, but didn't last long because there was only one knot of wind. So we motored, but it was good because we haven't had hot water for a few days because we haven't wanted to turn the engine on. So we'll be all having hot showers tonight, which will be nice. Um, yeah, so I've just come for a little fish. Still haven't caught anything. I'm convinced that there's no fish in Queensland anywhere, apart from the one spotty mac that we caught. But anyway, we will keep on trying. Well, we definitely aren't sailing today. We've got 0.8 knots of apparent wind, but I guess the top side to that is it's pretty much a glass out. It's so nice. We like, it felt like we're in a marina actually. It just felt like we we're on land last night while we were sleeping. It wasn't like an ounce of roll, which was really nice because we've just had some shocking rolling anchorages lately so it was nice I think that was the best night's sleep I have had since we left five weeks ago. So good. We left Shore Island and motored to Hamilton Island to pick up my dad and his partner Leanne. With perfect conditions forecasted for the next few days we made our way across to Chance Bay which is what you can see here. We spent the night here before exploring the iconic Whitehaven beach the very next day. Craigus, tell us who you are, where you're from, what you're doing here. <laughs> my, my name's Craigus. <laughs> I'm the father of Janelle and, and granddad of Adelaide. And we're on Janelle and Jono's boat. And we're currently at... Where are we? Whitehaven. <laughs> <laughs> Whitehaven. Very calm, very nice. Had a good night's sleep last night. And uh, looking forward to today. Now you know the conditions from here on out. 
No. Especially at this beach. No. You have to wear a G-string. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we won anyway, so. <laughs> so we've come to the beautiful Whitehaven beach this morning. Oh, beautiful as always. Yeah. Nice and calm. We stayed at Chance Bay last night. It was just stunning over there. A few midges, but that's all right. And then we pulled up anchor early this morning and came around to Whitehaven. Already been for a swim. Adeline's pretty tired. She was just non-stop for a couple of hours in the water. So we've come back for a break before round two. Look at this. Baywatch. I'll have coffee. Baywatch. Oh gosh. To regret doing that because I'm gonna be screwed today. <laughs> oh dear. It's nap time on MRA. I'll show you what we found. Cute. So we have arrived at Whitsunday Island. We're just going for a little walk up to the lookout that overlooks Whitehaven. So we've just come over and it's hot. This is going to be fun walking up with the toddler. Wish us luck. Monterey Bay is located at the northern end of Hook Island in the Whitsundays. It is known to be one of the best snorkeling and dive spots. We were excited to explore this underwater area as we had never been able to stop on previous visits due to unfavourable weather. With limited air in our dive tanks, thanks to COVID shutting down most of the dive shops in the area, we went for a quick dive to check it out for ourselves.
After a quick four days of trying to fit in as much exploring as we could, we said goodbye to Dad and Leanne, who left us in Ely Beach. As sad as it was saying goodbye to family, we were excited to begin our next adventure of checking out what the Whit Sundays had to offer. With no place to be, we certainly were not in any hurry to leave this place. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on seeing more beautiful Wood Sundays. Give us a thumbs up as every little bit helps. And if you haven't already, follow along on Instagram and Facebook for real-time updates. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.